Hello children. Good morning. Welcome all. Today we will start our class with a riddle. Can you answer me? Yes, here it is. I can run, but I don't have legs. I can fall, but I don't get hurt. I go solid in freezer. Who am I? Have you guessed children? Yes, it's water. Water is a substance that exists in three forms in nature. The solid form is ice, the liquid form is water and the gaseous form is water vapor. Water can change its state from one form to another form by heating or by cooling. Today we are going to learn about evaporation. Evaporation is a process by which a liquid changes into gas on heating. Children, when we heat a liquid such as water, we can see bubbles on the surface of the water. This we call it as boiling. When we continue heating it, we can observe that steam comes out of hot water. The steam is nothing but the gaseous form of water, which is a water vapor. This process we call it as evaporation. Evaporation commonly occurs in our day-to-day -day life. Let us see some examples. The best example for evaporation is drying of wet clothes under sun. Children, do you help your mom in drying clothes? Yes, I know you will do. When wet clothes are put under sun, the water in wet clothes absorbs heat energy from sun and gets evaporated making the clothes dry. That's why children Clothes dry faster in summer than in winter. Wet floor dries up because the water is evaporated due to heat which makes the floor completely dry. Now children, when your mom tells you to drink warm milk, what will you say? Ma, it's very hot. Let me drink after few minutes. Have you thought how a hot cup of milk gets cool after few minutes? It's also because of evaporation. Heat loss happens as the water evaporates from warm milk and it gets cooled down after some time. The next one is, in hot summer season, drying up of water bodies such as ponds, lakes and rivers due to evaporation of water in it. Children, you would have seen your mom cooking food in pressure cooker. While cooking, you all hear the whistle sound of pressure cooker, right? Yes. Have you seen steam comes out along with the whistle sound? If not, do watch it today. This is also due to evaporation. During cooking, a lot of heat is produced inside the pressure cooker. The liquid, that is water in the food, changes into water vapor and comes out as a steam. Evaporation is an important part in water cycle. Water in water bodies gets heated up by sun rays and changes into water vapor. As the water vapor rises up, it gets cooled down and forms clouds. So evaporation plays an important role in the formation of clouds. Other examples are drying of wet hair and evaporation of sweat from skin during summer season. Children, let's recall what we learnt. We learnt about evaporation. Evaporation is a process by which a liquid changes into gas on heating. Children, nowadays we all are using hand sanitizer much more than ever before to protect ourselves from COVID-19 infection, isn't it? Today, let's do an activity for evaporation by using this hand sanitizer. Now, apply hand sanitizer on your hands and rub gently. Children, now observe what happens immediately and after few minutes. The moment we apply hand sanitizer, we feel our hands are wet. After rubbing gently for few minutes, we feel our hands are dry. How it happens? It is because of evaporation. 
the sanitizer which is in liquid state changes into vapor by absorbing our body heat. So children, I hope you all are clear with the concept of evaporation and start observing the evaporation process around you. We will meet in next session. Till then, take care. Thank you children.